Now, I, 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 one of my favorite works of yours was the one about the Hungarian Revolution of 56. Very powerful. Very powerful. And I wanted to get your feelings. You really denounced oppressive Soviet communism in there. Yep. Uh, I couldn't think of a better person to ask, what do you think of the phenomenal changes we've just witnessed in the Soviet Union over the last month? Well, over the last 20 years, I have always been on uh, some board that has been fighting communism, uh, radio and the uh, State Department and so on. Last one, the radios in, in Berlin, I mean in uh, Munich. Right. Uh, so I've, I've been very deep in it. And uh, I knew that, uh, and the men I worked with, we knew that, uh, communism was on on very dangerous, very f uh, fragile ground. That is the Soviet Union. I had been in, in a, gr a great deal of it, and I knew that the outlying appendages were very fragile. But I never thought it would collapse in this century. So Even though I, I I was about as well informed as most American citizens. And, far more than some people I hear are rating about it. Yes. But even I didn't realize it was as, as rotten at the core as it was. Yes. Uh, I knew that it was very dangerous along the borders. I knew that the Baltics and, and uh, Ukraine and uh, Romania and so on were very fragile appendages. But it all happened infinitely faster than I expected. Did the coup of, uh, 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 surprise you, the fact that the Gorbachev's uh, uh, terrified. T t terrified you? I thought, well, now remember that the coup in China uh, reversed history. Yes. Tiananmen Square reversed history. And I thought, oh, my God, here we go again. But, uh, again, the uh, uh, Russia was far more resilient and powerful than the coup members had discussed. And there never was a more stupid coup than that one. Yes, I was going to say that was... That was re that was unbelievable. She, if somebody were to write that in, in, in one of your novels, uh, you wouldn't... Oh, uh, the editors would gag. My God, they would say, are you kidding with this thing? And, and what do you think of, of Boris Yeltsin, who is now a, a national hero? And uh... well, I don't know Yeltsin very well. Uh, I, uh, I had resigned from, uh, I'd withdrawn from uh, the radios. Before he came on the scene, I would have been well versed, had, it, had I been still there, but uh, he's a new man to me. His performance during the coup is simply impeccable. Yes. The, the, that scene of him standing on a tank telling oh his God, yes. his people not to... That, that'll live in history for years, Mr. Mitchell. Years. When he had uh, good advice that he was on the death list. Yes. He knew that. This was a, this was a fantastic uh, show of courage. Tremendous. I, I have wonderful admiration for that man. And is he, um, uh, th there's kind of a mixed feeling about him. Some people say he's just a very ambitious uh, political man who wants great power. And I think both he and Nelson Mandela are loose cannons. So, I would let it go at that. All right. Because we, we, we do not know what's going to happen. Yes, yes. And, and, and every day there's a, there's a different change. Yep. Yeah. How about your thoughts? Uh, 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 Time magazine calls Gorbachev the man of the decade, let alone the man of the year. What are your thoughts on Mikhail Gorbachev from a historical standpoint? Uh, he, he, uh, he has played a, uh, a, an historic role in allowing uh, the German, the East Germans, to go into Berlin. Yes. Uh, go across the border in Berlin and allowing uh, uh, Poland to go its way and allowing uh, Hungary to do what it did. Uh, he is a heroic figure. Yes. He may have outlived his uh, usefulness at the moment. There's some signs of that, but that was true of Churchill. 
Yes. In the great after the great victory over Germany, the British threw him out. It's, a, it's amazing how they could they could do that. Uh, um, you know, he he was so helpful. He saved England, and then they threw him out in a subsequent election. Yes, but he was not running for office in the United States. Yes. He was running for office, or France, or Italy. Yes. He was running for office in England, and it was time for somebody else. Yes, yes, I understand.